All right, morning guys, fishing the odds. Today we're doing some ocean fishing. We got Charles here. Yeah, what's up guys? Coming to the fishing the odds side of things. I think this time I'm gonna do a little bit more fishing than when we can steal it. Yeah, you're, we'll get him. And then we got Wesley over here, subscriber. So we're gonna get out there and chase some coho, do some crabbing, and do some rock fishing. And hopefully we got a meat haul. So stay tuned guys. Motoring out. You guys excited? All right, guys, we're gonna start dropping pots right now. Third pots going in. One more pot after this, and then we're gonna go coho fishing, guys. I think we're gonna run south. Here we go. Just started trolling. Haven't found them, it's been about 15 minutes. I want my money back. You can have your money back. I'm about ready to go. Thank you. I want my gas money back. Which, uh, which rod can we go off for? I'm thinking this back rod. I'm thinking your rod. All right, guys, Wes is on a fish. I loosened it because it was really tight. Oh, it's going to be a lot of bait right here. Oh yeah, we're 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 all pretty deep. Up, up, up. Got him. Yeah, buddy. Nicely done. It's fishing fishing the dream, man. Look at that thing. Beautiful. That's a gorgeous go, man. Good job on getting us on the fish, man. Yeah, we it takes a team, you know what I mean? Oh yeah. Nice fish. There. You wanna hold this? It's already filming. Charles Barkley. Charles Barkley. That looks like a tiger, dude. That's a good one, dude. We got drop that one down. We got a KCP on there, and it yeah, drop it down deeper. Dropped it deeper and almost instant takedown. Just goes to show you, you got to keep switching it up until you find something that works. Oh, it's a chin hook, dude. Could be a chin hook. <laughs> that casting rod is just a nice rod. Nice net job. Yeah. You want pliers? Yeah. They're right there. Go ahead, go ahead. Here, Charles. Yeah. 
Alright. Just released our first native of the day. Uh, mix it up a little bit. Instead of the spin fish, we threw on a mini cup plug, coconut cup plug actually. And uh, got bit. So. Oh, Wes, he's on again, boys. He on there? Oh yeah. That's your limit. Wes, I got a limit. Right on, bud. Come here, Wesley. Come hold your fish. Wesley got his second keeper, guys. Over there. Oh, he's right yeah. here. Hell yeah, guys. Nice. Good, Good work. Lay that fish on the floor. We'll get that cold water bleed bag out. We'll get that cold water bleed bag out, and we'll get it blend. Ah. See, when you're on, you're on. It's on. So we basically started off south this morning, dropped our pots north, and then ran as far south as we could. Uh, seen nothing, heard nothing, caught nothing. So we got a report head north, and then we headed north, and now we're at about 295 feet. So you gotta chase these fish, man. They're One day they're out south, one day they're north, one day they're west, so. We chased a report, and it worked out for us, and we got Wesley Limit, so. Pretty good so far. Pretty good. Going. Stick around, guys, we're, we're still searching. Get a couple more. A couple more. Serious. Oh, man. As soon as I put it up. There you go, there you go, there you go. Oh, yeah. Yep, yep. Grab it. Oh. Oh, God, you see him drag. Serious. Everything goes crazy. That was a good takedown. He was dragging. That's stronger than that. Got that. Oh no! Woo! Well, yeah, dude, good job. Fish in the boat. Lucky guy, lucky fish. Yeah. Took a lead. Took a lead to the face. Just start. Just uh, just release another native, guys. Gonna rebate and get our gear back down there. We're heading towards that last waypoint that you have. It's been the hot, the hot uh, ticket right there. Coming in, nice, seven, six, five, four. I'll lift the leg. Little, it's not bad. Take that camera out with that. Take yes. it. Yes! Oh. Nice. Small adult, but it's an adult. Why'd you eat it that hard, dude? There you go, guys. Yeah. That's the little hatchery coho. Yeah. We'll get them bled, get them fed. Wait. These coho are not where they were. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll get the net. 
Okay. How's it feel, Charles? It feels good. I told you that one to get drilled. We're all in butt hoodies. We can slow down a little bit. Oh, there he is. Double, double. Double, double. double. All right, folks. So we got we got four keepers now. We got two more to go. It's been a grind today. Um, I just lost Charles and I just had a double, and then we lost one right at the boat. So what can you do? What can you do? Uh, release a few native fish, and we're just out here trying to make it happen. So we got another. I don't know. We're right in the zone. We're right with right here. Oh, yeah. oh right, right there. We're right in the waypoints, guys. And this is where we've been getting bit. So. Stick around. Get some more fish. Yeah. And we had double, dude. Nice. I lost mine like half the I know, month. dude. I see it turn out the decent size on too. We're hooking this fish. Finally. I'm not gonna change this piece. Look at that, boys. Nice coho right there. Oh my god, I got a fish. Oh god, yeah. Oh, I did. On the real up. Oh, I did. Oh my god. Here, we'll reel it in, Wesley. Like the box. Alright, put film back in now. Here. All right, guys, we are done. This is our last fish. That's, That's our last fish. Time to go do some rock fishing. We're going to do some rock Let's fishing. Go do it. Six kilo. It took longer than we expected. Trust me. It took longer than we expected. It's like 11, 30, 12 o'clock right now. But we did get them. We're happy about it. So stay tuned. Hit that subscribe button. Look at all this Little long tail. Fresh as it gets. This one bit on the reel up. The hottest lure of the day, man, was this... Uh, Yakima Bay spinfish, but basically it's just that chartreuse with some pink, and then I just paired that up with a pink high class taco hoochie. And the second to that was a Brad's uh, cup plug. So it was pretty good fishing all day. Um, it wasn't, it wasn't as good as it was a couple days ago. We did have to put in a lot of effort today for our fish, and 
thanks to a report, my buddy Brian told me to come down to where I'm sitting right now because I went south and we had no fish. Like we couldn't touch a fish to save our lives. So we came, we came north. We put it a long ways. It was a 35 minute run to get here. Sometimes it pans off, guys. Sometimes it doesn't. Chasing reports can be deadly, but it worked for us. So stay tuned. We're gonna go rock fishing right now and get after it. That's two in a row. Oh, I might. Um, I'm in view. No, you're not. Why not? No, I got a bat. Where are you in view, though? Yeah, I'm running the boat. Oh, at least we got a bat. Huh? Yep. I got fish, dude. Let's see what it is. I think it's small. As long as it's a bass, huh? Here we go. Wesley's got a nice rock on. Finally found him, I think. Let's see. Hopefully it's bigger than the last one. Yeah, they were still in them, guys. Should be getting bit. Ooh, bring it in. That's a nice bass. Oh, yeah. One. Nice, bud. Nice. There we go. Another bass. All right, folks. We ended up with like five rockfish. It wasn't the best. Everything's been a grind today, um, but that's that's fishing. Some days, some days you get them, some days you grind and still get them. Some days you don't get them at all. That's just the way it goes. We're gonna go check our crab pots right now. We got four of them soaking. They've been soaking for quite a while. Um, so we should should have some good crab. Let's go take a look. You guys excited? Oh yeah. I'm ready. You want crab, don't you, Wesley? Oh yeah. Crab's always good. I'll take a couple of crab. You want some crab? Yep. I'll take a couple of those. I'll give up my co for a couple of crab. What about you? You gonna give up your co for a couple of crab? It comes down to it. Comes down to it. <laughs> Good looking crab. Good looking crab. Is that still filming? Yep. That's a keeper right there. Don't even have to measure it, but I will for the camera. <laughs> keeper. You know what I mean? Keeper, oh, yeah, keeper. keeper. There's a few. So, all the keepers we're going to throw in this black go back. Nice. It's alright. We'll take some crab meat. Even if it's just a little bit. It's still good. Hell yeah, dudes. We got five keepers so far in two pots, so hopefully we can get ten in the next two. We'll see what happens. What the f that's not possible, dude. Last pot of the day, folks. Look at those rockfish. Oh, there's a keeper in there. We got six keepers. Ah, well, six ain't bad for July, I guess, huh? Not too bad. 
<clears throat> Alright folks, six six keepers. We're gonna head in now and uh, cook them up and play some fish and yada yada. Back in the bay. Back in the bay. Back in the bay. We'll play some fish here once we get to the dock. The important bit, and it has a wider belly. So. They're so similar. I can see I why people could screw that up. Yeah, it's a dangerous one, but. All right. Yeah. Thanks. So, thank you. Take care. Thank you. Have a good day. All right, guys. So here's another salmon we've got to fillet real quick. Checker just checked our fish. Let us know that we have legal coppers and not quillbacks. Now we're gonna, now I'm just knocking all the fins off real quick. That's the way I like to flay the fish. You don't wanna go too, too deep on this cut. Get rid of all these fins. Makes it in a nice and clean cut, guys. And you just run your knife up the belly. Okay. Get right here behind this gill plate. Ooh, this one's got some eggs in her. Find that back. Lay it off. Easy money. Flip the fish over. Ooh, look at how much that's been eating. Look at that. Ooh. We'll, we'll cut that open. You guys can take a look at what's inside. That's the belly. So I'm just tracing that back. I ran into the fillet mat, but perfect fillets. Nice skinny on the bone. That's it, guys. So let's take a look at this belly. Oh wow, look at that. <laughs> Big ol' herring, huh? That's what it looks like to me. There's more in there. So this fish has been eaten. Anyway guys, just, just showed you what's in the belly here. This fish was obviously eating a lot of herring. We literally grinded, we went south, we went north, we put a lot of miles on the boat today. Uh, it's been a lot of gas, but that's okay. That's what it takes sometimes to find these beautiful coho. This meat is firm, nice solid meat. Uh, this is a brand new fishing fillet table I got. It locks in the gunnel just perfectly. And yeah, does the job. So got the spray down hose. We'll just wash everything down when we're done and, and get on with it. But hit that subscribe button. Hopefully you enjoy this video. Today was a grind. Some days are a grind. That's how ocean coho goes. Crabbing, we only got six keepers rockfish we only got five so it's been tough guys but hopefully you enjoyed can you said you release like one small rockfish yes one, one black